Yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Poontan Gaming here. Thinking about a, a video about Adam Mukaka. Probably say that name pretty fucked up, but I don't really care. So let's talk about this French guy. Okay, could he be the f French basketball version of my papa or my papa? I don't even know. So, with that being said, he's six five. He's from Paris, France. Uh, he grew up going through the BCM, with Gravity's Dirt League, won the U National U21 Championship with them 2014-2015. He's in the top flight French team right now. Night plays for Mega BX uh, is a Serbian and Adriatic League team, and they're a Serbian club. And right now, uh, he's never really averaged that many minutes besides 14 minutes in his year before Begamax. If I look at some stats right there I can probably find that he was probably like older or younger uh, not older or younger better or worse in his season but honestly I just want to give you a rundown of who this guy is why I like him okay he is just so length lengthy 6'5 but has a 6'10 wingspan he's a strong physical profile for a combo guard he's definitely only a 2 guard because he doesn't have a good assist ratio and he's kind of turnover Prone, very chiseled frame. He's in great condition for being about, I think, it's 20, 21 years old. He's got long arms, very lanky man, has very good lateral quickness. He's a very good defender for how young and raw he is, and he's an athletic freak, so he has the potential to be an all-pro defender. Uh, terrific rebounder, getting 8.8 .8 per 40 minutes at the U18s. Strong first step in line, like Jimmy Butler, he just can yam it down. I think he can be one, one of the best 3 and D players to come out of this draft. He's unselfish because he played in the EuroLeague. Very committed player, loves to do pull-ups, loves just to take three-pointers. Like I said, he's more of a two-guard at this point, and his jumper isn't good, but you know, it has a really good form and arc to it that I know if he just puts the work into it, it's just going to be a great jumper. So with me, I think he's going to go around the, the end of the first round or be the first or second pick of the second draft because he might have to be a year Euro stash. Like his stats don't indicate anything to blow your mind, but I'm telling you, I think he could have the potential of being the biggest sleeper of this draft, aka the biggest steal of the draft because we haven't seen somebody with these raw talents and all these intangibles coming from Euro basketball. That just doesn't happen. So, you know, he grew up playing the game different and he has the potential to be great and see, I see Gian, <clears throat> Giannis level of success. So please let me know down below what you guys think. Where do you think he's gonna get drafted? Like I said, I think he's gonna be at end of the first, maybe like the Spurs and or one of the first couple picks of the second round. So that's about it, guys. I hope you guys have a great day, because I know I will. Until next time, guys, peace out.